If you are cutting into any sort of timber, especially sheet material, it's quite helpful to have the whole thing up on a bench, but you want to look after the bench you're cutting on, especially if it's your outdoor table or something like that. So I keep these, gluts, spaces, blocks, call them whatever you want. They're basically just a stick of timber with two smaller pieces attached to the bottom for stability that I lay on the bench. Then I just grab the piece I want to cut and it's well clear of the table below. And away I go, the saw blade stays well off the table and I stay out of trouble. Now, if you are cutting right through a piece, it can be helpful to have a third one of these. Like that, so that when you finish your cut, one piece doesn't fall down and jam onto the saw blade which causes real problems. It's a pretty simple solution to protect your table and make your DIY life heaps easier. For your more regular everyday cutting of bits and pieces, there is what is called a bench hook. Now you can see there's one piece of timber attached to the top side of a sheet of ply. This is just an offcut. Any sort of sheet material will do. On the other side, there's another piece. The two are kind of opposite. One provides a hook for the bench, the other one provides a backing, something to push your timber against to hold it steady while you cut. Use the end of that block as a guide for your saw if you need to. Too easy. The piece is cut to length, the dining room table is unmarked and that is a bonus. Now for more tips and ideas on DIY around your place, subscribe to the channel. You get regular updates on when new videos go online. Ow.